so we have seen the in the previous video we have seen example using the radio buttons so radio buttons can be created using the lists also so instead of uh, creating the radio buttons like this we can also create using the list also so for that let us create a list so for list we can create the lang uh, the radio buttons let us say languages is equal to now let us create a list let us say python comma value is 1 comma same thing pearl comma 2 let us say c to make it simple 3 and let us create one more thing ruby comma 4 so we have created a list now instead of writing all this let me delete this now we will be looping in the languages list and creating a radio buttons so for that let us write for loop for let us say text comma value in languages radio button root comma text is equal to txt let us pad the x is equal to 25 and variable is equal to v everything is same command is equal to triple m and one more thing value is equal to this one value is equal to value so for every one everything it will be looping and creating a radio button and dot pack anchor is equal to w that's all let us see the output first see same result so we can create using the for loop also both are same and execution should be same whenever we click python it should come like like this execute some code we will be writing some useful code in the real time but to illustrate this to understand how to use these radio buttons we have written simple text welcome to python programming so we, there is a one more type of radio buttons so let me show you the output of this program first so so instead of having radio buttons with circular holes containing white spaces as in this example here so we can have the radio button with the complete text in a box so we can do this by setting the indicator on option to zero which means that there will be no separate radio button indicators so by defaultly the indicator on is set so that will be off will be switching off this radio buttons the white space ones and if once you see the output you will be understanding it better so for that we should have to just 
pass one more argument which is indicator on is equal to zero zero that's all by default it is one now we are switching off that one now let us see the output see here instead of the radio buttons like with the circular holes containing white spaces now we are getting a complete text box text in the box so let us make some changes for the better looking let us set the width is equal to 25 now execute it see here according to this look much better so now you can choose anyone like ruby c if you press pearl python like that pearl hope you understood so what you should have to do as by default actually this argument is set to one so now what we are doing we are making it zero so we are switching off that one so and we are giving the width that's all the the rest of the thing is same as the radio buttons we have practiced in our previous videos hope you understood keep practicing meet you in the next video with another topic